to have a wedding customer. Okay, you're on. She, she was, she would come in, she was a photographer when I, we had just the lab. She would actually, she's a very religious woman, she would actually pray over her film before she would bring it in. She would literally say a prayer over it. <laughs> because until you actually develop the film, you don't know. And, and even then, labs destroy film. I mean, that's the great thing about digital. We're shooting both, you know, but it, it is really, digital has really relieved a lot of photographers because you can shoot a picture, look at it and go, yeah, it's a good picture, I don't need to shoot another one. Right. Yeah. Right. So anyway, the purpose of the contract is informational. It's, it's all the stuff that, that we need to know from us and you need to know, uh, we both need to know from each other to, to help this go smoothly, all right? Uh, date, time, uh, the wedding is, they're in the same place, that's not very explanatory, but, but fill out that as much as you can and uh, number in the wedding party and also the, the form about the uh, uh, wedding coordinator goes, that's kind of duplication, but this form actually goes to your wedding coordinator, all right? And it helps you kind of prioritize uh, the people you're dealing with and, and if you forgot something, that's part of what also the questions are about too, to, to help you think about things that, that maybe you didn't think about before because it's, it's very stressful, you know, weddings. Uh, our wedding packages start at $2,000. All right, and that includes all the coverage. That's uh, up to six hours coverage, okay. and and uh, all the prints we shoot. We don't put any limits on on prints. I mean, you get everything. You get all the rights to it. Okay. We don't we don't hide the rights anymore. I mean, that used to be a big selling tool for people. We don't do that. I mean, they're your pictures. It's your wedding. All right. Uh, there is a stipulation for overtime, but we're very flexible on that. I mean, after about twelve hours, I start getting wore out. So. <laughs> all right. Uh, sure. The most, one of the most important things is any special situations. I mean, anything at all that's, you know, I, the only wedding I ever was booked for and didn't end up doing two days before the, the groom's uncle passed away and they, so they just eloped. But you know, that's, I mean, that's, you know, that, that's one of those weird circumstances. Uh, you guys sit down, go over that, uh, fill it out the best you can. You can either fax it to me or, or we'll get back together again. All right. All right. Uh, the 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 bridesmaids, the the number and their names really help a lot. Okay. Uh, one sister. You got one brother too, right? Two brothers. Two brothers. I thought she just had one. Okay. Uh, and feel free to just scribble over any of this stuff. Let you know. Give me more information than than less. All right. Okay. Okay. And the actual weddings again. Is it one? Is that right? It is at six o'clock. Six at night. Ooh, that's even better. I was wrong. It's at six. That's great. That'll be good light. And, and they are done at 11 here, aren't they? Yep, done at 11, okay. Uh, how, approximately how many people are invited? Um, about 200 are invited, so okay. probably about 150. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. Uh, there was a couple things on, on the questions list I might want to go over you with. Um, how do you feel about us having cameras on the table just so people can snap pictures? Uh, I got, that's one of the things I want to bring up. I have no problem with people taking pictures. None at all. Okay. Zilch. Uh, I can give you a little advice on that one if you'd like. If you're going to do that, find people that you want to give those cameras to and say, here's a camera. Every wedding I've ever shot where they put them on the table, the kids grab them, run around, shoot a whole roll of nothing because they don't know how to activate the flash. Outside it's not too bad. Outside they do okay. But find people you trust and give those two cameras okay. to. It, I mean the table, table's okay, but t kids usually end up with those and okay. yeah. Okay. <laughs> just, just a word of advice. Where did my little cheat sheet of questions go? Oh, possible questions. Uh, we can go over some of these. Uh, wedding coordinator, again, can't stress how important that is. Uh, uh, we've talked about avoiding each other, or not, uh, not seeing each other before the wedding. Uh, this place is great because if, you, if, if there's inclement weather, right. you can come in here, that they, they have that covered. Uh, changing room covered, uh, two different locations, it's not. Any special wardrobe considerations? Is it going to be a theme wedding? I mean, we've had cowboy weddings. We've had, you know, there's a wedding one time where the uh, uh, 
Everyone at the wedding was supposed to dress in black except for the bride. She was in white. I didn't get the memo. I was there in a brown suit. <laughs> a little out of place. Okay. okay. Uh, receiving line, that's, that's huge. Uh, receiving lines in between, uh, if you have them before you do the group picture, people come up and they're always hugging you and mauling you, and typically it messes your makeup up. Mm -hmm. that's, that's, very, that's a very big thing. That's something to think about. Uh, typically, the, the guests can wait. When we do most of those pictures before the wedding, the guests can wait uh, to eat. Are you guys going to have food? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, DJ or live? DJ. DJ, okay. All right. Uh, are you going to do all the traditional wedding, uh, the dance with the father? Yes. Okay, uh, throw the bouquet. Do you have a spare bouquet, a throwing bouquet? I do. Cool. Uh, uh, good garter shot. Okay. All those traditional. I, I take. I bet you got a list, and my list covers that a little bit. All. It's actually excellent. Okay. Yeah. Uh, some of this stuff applies to me. I mean, we have backup equipment. Okay. I've had people want to come and inspect my equipment before the, the wedding. Say, we want to look at your. <laughs> we want to look at your stuff. All right. Uh, that covered your. Uh, Allowing people to take pictures before the wedding or during the wedding. Don't have a problem with that. Flower girl is. Uh, it's gonna be Kayla. Okay, is she got someone? Is she gonna be able to do it? We a little fuzzy on that. Is um, I wasn't sure about how we were gonna do that quite yet. Sometimes people have escorts. It's still cute. Yeah. You know, it's 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 your call. If she will go up to you, okay. you know, if she'll run to you. Okay, it's that's just something to think about. Uh, do you guys need any pre-wedding photos done? Some people have some people have pictures made, and they have a posed picture um, at the at the wedding. If you guys need any of that, um, I don't think so. Okay, all right. Uh, this is what I talked about earlier about someone in charge of the bride and groom okay. personal items, uh, who cleans up after the. I mean, here they've got it pretty well covered. Just some things to think about. All right. Okay. 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 Any questions right now? I mean, okay. anything at all. Covered most of everything I had a question about. Yeah. yeah. And if you think of anything, don't hesitate to call. Okay. Because I, 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 we really enjoy doing them. You give me a thumbs up saying yes. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Give me. Yeah.